In this video, we're going to go over mirroring and some shortcuts that make it a million times faster than what the stock moto does. So first of all, I'm going to start off with the cube, control drag to create it. And let's put it over to the side of the grid a little bit. And now I'm going to copy paste control C control V and move it out to the corner to this outside corner here as kind of a registration mark. So let's uh, let's do control Q to cut that out. Now to mirror this all I have to do is press shift V and choose a direction. So I've got Y, Z, X. This time let's try going on X. Let's try again shift V going on Z, shift V going on Y. Uh, actually, let me undo that last one. Let's move these up a little bit because we're going to mirror across that plane and then shift V, Y. So that's great. Let's keep going with this um, and look at how to manipulate this after the fact. So if I try to move, so W to move, uh, this is a little bit awkward if I want to keep the symmetry. So if I want to keep the symmetry, I'm going to press V. And you can see up here, it turns on symmetry, it toggles it on and off. Um, right now it's set to Y, which you can also see up here. If I press move, I can see that it's moving Y. Also notice that the tool handle here, right now it's centered only on these top ones because we're in symmetry mode. If I press V, it's centered on all of them. So notice how that center changes. Um, so now let's say, all right, I, I want to adjust this to something like this. And uh, now I want to adjust this way on the Z axis. So to quickly do that, I can press Control Shift V to get my symmetry options and switch the axis to Z. And you can see that the handle changes depending on which axis. And now I'm just going to just move off of it. And now I've got my Z symmetry. And all right, let's do one more time. Control Shift V, switch it to X, and play around with that. So now, just keep in mind, you can always turn symmetry on or off pressing V key and now um, let's say I want to move all of these off to the side so I've got my symmetry off and I'm moving these all off to the side now if I um, want to mirror just this one I can select this these polygons here double clicking then select the edge and the same thing shift V and then mirror Y so by selecting the edge, we tell Moto where to mirror around. So let me undo that. And this time I'm going to select nothing. I'm clicking off the polygon. So I actually have everything selected now. Um, and let's select that one edge next. And then Shift V, mirror on Y. Now let's pick this bottom edge, Shift V, mirror on Z and pick this edge here, shift V, mirror on Y. Oops, mirror on X, nope. Oh, I had this one selected, so I have to click off of it. Pick here, shift V, mirror X. And we can keep going this way. Mirror Z, mirror Y. Oops, mirror Z. Okay. And again, this functionality is not uh, native in Moto. So if you're looking for these scripts, you need to go back to the first video in this series, uh, Intro to Moto number one, which will show you where to get the scripts and how to install it and all that stuff. So anyways, thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.